Yeah, he's right. right. <laughs> kind of wanders around. Are you guys all ready? We're ready. Okay. We're done it. Welcome to the finance meeting. Mr. McGowan. Thank you. I'm glad I'm not the only one who yells at him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. There he is. All right. <laughs> Great wanderer. Waiting for the life of the party to arrive. <laughs> All right, good morning and welcome to the Finance Committee meeting. Uh, first order of business always is to approve last month's committee meeting minutes. Motion made by Supervisor Garrity, seconded by Supervisor Frazier. All in favor? Aye. Opposed? Carried. Okay. On to the action agenda. Number one, we have referrals from the Criminal Justice and Public Safety Committee under Sheriff. Item A, we have a request to amend the county budget in the amount of $522,261 to reflect the receipt of grant funding from the 2018 statewide interoperability program. I move it. Motion made by Supervisor Strauss, seconded by Supervisor Dickinson. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Carried. B is a request to transfer. Uh, for a transfer of funds in the amount of $6,795 from the contingent account to pay for an update to the crash data retrieval software and hardware for the traffic safety unit. Uh, motion made by Supervisor Gary, seconded by Supervisor Dickinson. I don't recall this one for some reason. Yeah, we talked about this in committee. About sharing it with other counties, I believe. That was like, yeah, I, I'm going to vote no on this because I think that the, I know it's um, something we need, but I'm not sure how often we have homicides that we have to investigate why we couldn't share with other counties instead of purchasing our own equipment all the time. So our neighboring county is paying for some of this or we're paying for the whole thing? No, this is what he said that we need this for certain cases that they take to court and the oh. question was asked can can we share this with other counties oh, okay. at the time okay. we didn't so that was the discussion gotcha okay. I recollect. all right um, any other discussion all those in favor aye, aye. opposed oh. one opposed uh, moving on to two, we have a referral from the Health, Human, and Social Services Committee. Under mental health, we have a request to amend the county budget in the amount of $60,000 to reflect the receipt of grant funding from New York State Office of Alcoholism and Substance Abuse Services. I move it. Motion second. made by Supervisor Garrity, seconded by Supervisor McDevitt. Just, just do you have a, a question, Mr. Just, Supervisor? Uh, yes, I do. I, I second it, but also I just have a question. I asked uh, Sean this the other day. It uh, seems like we have a degree of inconsistency here. Uh, uh, great program. We're going to permit uh, experts in substance abuse to come into the facility and to, to teach, instruct, uh, change behavior. But uh, currently the, uh, the Sheriff's Department does not permit members of AA uh, into the <coughs> facility. Uh, and I, I don't understand what the answer to that is, okay? Members of AA are volunteers. Uh, they they have a program uh, to uh, support and help. Uh, just don't know why they're permitted into state correctional facilities around the state of New York. Uh, I, I, I agree. I can answer. Yeah, I agree, and I think maybe we should bring that up to uh, Chairman Leggett's committee uh, the next time that we meet. I think it's sure. a great idea. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Supervisor Frazier. Well, I just thought the question was asked that day. They asked Sean about AA, and it, my impression was they hadn't shown any interest in going into the jail. I, I didn't get the impression that they said no, that they couldn't come. Maybe I wasn't listening, but I do remember Sean was asked that question. I do remember them bringing it up, yes. I, but but did, did he actually come out and say no, we don't uh, let he, them come? He, I didn't think that was uh, the case. No, he said no. They are not permitted into the facility. Oh, so I guess I missed the word. Do you mean you talked to him offline? No, I talked oh. to him uh, during, during the actual that meeting. Was, was but he did say to me he would get back to me with an answer. Okay. Hmm. So. Yeah. Supervisor Brown. I'm surprised because he, the undersheriff seemed um, re very receptive to this um, jail-based substance abuse Absolutely. treatment, as well as no. uh, not an additional program that we're working on to help with the help. transition of people who are leaving, you know, mm -hmm. being discharged from the jail and going into some community-based. So I'd be surprised that he wouldn't that the jail 
wouldn't want to offer that if the AA people are even willing to come into the jail. They, That's they, a whole they, other question. They are. Uh, mm -hmm. the, uh, uh, but I, our mental health director was here, and I, I know he has ex ex you know, mentioned that to me on more than one occasion. So it just uh, seems like if we're trying to help people, we let, uh, we let folks in our community into the facility to, yeah. to help the inmates. Mm -hmm. I agree with you, Peter, but I'm I'm not I'm not drawing a line between what you're saying and this. Yeah. Right. Two separate things. <laughs> is there yeah. is there are you just making No no I, no I, I support I support both things of what I, I support okay. what right. we're doing okay. here. Okay. I just wanted to make sure absolutely one hundred percent support these. I hundred percent agree yeah. with you. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we do have a motion and a second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Carried. Item three, referral from Public Works, DPW is a request to amount the county budget in the amount of $509.15 to reflect the receipt of insurance recovery funds to repair and vehicle. Motion made by Supervisor Garrity, second by Supervisor Beatty. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. All those carried. Four, Support Services Committee, County Administrator. Um, we have in the packet the typical uh, journal report of transfers if there are any questions. No, no, no. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, the oh, credit card policy. Credit, credit card policy. I got ahead of myself. This is uh, we uh, are authorizing the tourism department. It was put. Uh, it was approved by the tourism committee, as well as the support services committee, to uh, utilize a, a credit card. The uh, current credit cards uh, we tend to get to the maximum uh, before we've. Uh, we're able to spend what they need to spend when they go on their conferences. Uh, so this uh, resolution is to amend the credit card policy to allow that to happen. I'll move it. Motion made by Supervisor Dickinson, seconded by Supervisor Brammer. Any discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Carried. Five requests. Uh, or items to be discussed by the county administrator. Now you can go ahead to your... Uh, now we have the journal report. Any questions? Okay. B? Uh, this is a, a, a resolution to uh, finish up the transfers for 2019 from the vehicle reserve into departmental operating budgets. Uh, Tammy has worked uh, very closely with the departments on this. Uh, the only deviation we had from the initial plan is to uh, uh, public health uh, came to us with the idea of getting rid of three of their Ford Fiestas, uh, they've been problematic vehicles, and getting one SUV uh, to uh, accommodate uh, bad weather and driving up north. Uh, so that will net out to $13,000 and uh, we've come up with savings in 2020 that will balance that out. Okay. Motion made by Supervisor Frazier, seconded by Supervisor Strau. Discussion? On favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Carry. Okay. And the third item is the item that I uh, just presented to the personnel committee about 10 minutes ago, uh, if there are any further questions on that. Well, we, I have one seeing that uh, we are adjusting this. Where is the money coming? We uh, may have some savings uh, as a result of interest arbitration. That's not final yet. Uh, but uh, if we do, that'll be in the contingency account. Uh, so uh, if that, if, yeah, yeah, uh, it, it'll either come from contingency or a fund balance appropriation. What was the final total amount? Uh, the total amount, we'll get an exact total from the treasurer's office if, uh, if uh, it's the will of the board to move forward with this. But the, uh, the total that I gave on the uh, the handout for personnel uh, was uh, fifty-four thousand. Fifty-four thousand. Yeah. Now that is based just on uh, the salaries uh, annualized. We would only have seventy-five percent of that, and then when you factor in the uh, FICA and the pension contribution, it'll be about that. I'll move that. Okay. To come out of contingency, correct? I, I would propose not doing the, the not budget doing piece until after it, it, it goes through the board. We can figure, have the treasurer's office calculate wh exactly what we need, and we could do the budget piece uh, next time. Okay. Motion made by Supervisor Garrity, seconded by Supervisor Dickinson. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Carried. Okay, and then on item six, we have um, the action is required for items that were done in personnel and higher education, and those are 2C through E, 3A through C, and 4A and B. Made by Supervisor Garrity. You're hot today. <laughs> Seconded by Supervisor Straub. I want to help you out. All those in favor? <laughs> Aye. Aye. Opposed? Carry. <laughs> uh, no pending items, and that leaves privilege of the floor. Anyone willing to and wishing <coughs> to address the Finance Committee? 
Motion to adjourn. Made by Supervisor <laughs> Dickinson, second by Supervisor Shroud. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Thank you. Thanks. Wow. Wow.